Hello and welcome to the STPCon Sponsor Orientation video. My name is Rick Bauckham. Just wanted to welcome you guys and thank you for your participation in STPCon this year. Uh, without the sponsors, uh, we'd have a hard time putting on conferences like this and we really enjoy having your support and we look forward to supporting you in any way we can. All this information I'm going to go over will be on the web on stpcon.com forward slash sponsor dash resources. So if you have any specific questions about how to get engaged uh, in the conference and uh, get set up and get ready, um, you can go on that web page and find out everything that I'm basically mentioning here. So just to introduce the staff of STPCon, it's myself, Rick, I'm the Interactive uh, Communications Manager here. We've got James Steiner, uh, he is one of our Speaker Logistics and uh, Event Managers, um, really great guy to talk to you. We've got Peggy Libby, who's the CEO of STPCon, and all three of us will be on site. You'll see us running around, we'll have matching shirts on the whole time we're here. If you have any questions, feedback, anything, just uh, come up to any of us and uh, We'll either answer your question, get you taken care of, or uh, just listen to your feedback. We really appreciate that kind of stuff. So just to give you an idea of where we are, we are in Newport Beach, California. We're really close to the John Wayne Orange County Airport, or SNA. Uh, it's just about four miles northwest of here. It's very easy to get to the hotel from the airport. Uh, you can take a taxi. It's about 20 bucks, you can take a lift, it's about 12 bucks. Same with an Uber, about $12. So uh, you can get here very easily from, from the airport. The Newport Beach Marriott Hotel and Spa, that's where we are, we're out here in the Rose Garden right now. Chances are this is where we will hold our evening reception, uh, the welcome reception and expo on Wednesday night. So it's gonna be an outdoor event. We'll probably bring you guys some sunscreen, that'll be important. Um, but we'll be out here from basically about 5 o'clock to 7 o'clock. We'll have hors d'oeuvres, we'll have food, uh, we'll have the prize giveaway, we'll have all sorts of fun, so, and some music as well. Make sure that you've made your staff's reservations as soon as possible. The chances of this hotel selling out uh, before the uh, hotel cutoff is very good. So we want to make sure that you guys have your staff here ready to rock and roll. They don't have to drive from any other location. It's just very important. The hotel cutoff is March 16th and uh, you can get the room rate of $199 between now and then. And again, I really recommend uh, booking your hotel rooms as soon as possible. So you can do that online uh, at stpcon.com forward slash hotel. So to go over the schedule, just so you guys know, basically how STPCon is set up, we have two days of workshops, which are on Monday, Tuesday, April 9th and 10th. We also have two days of sessions uh, and, and the keynotes, and that's actually the STPCon part of the conference. That's gonna be on April 11th and 12th, that's Wednesday and Thursday. The important thing for you guys to know about is the actual welcome reception. That's gonna be held on Wednesday evening, from five to seven, as I mentioned, probably here in the Rose Garden. We've got a beautiful view of a, a country club golf course right out here, and the ocean is just beyond that. Some fabulous sunsets so far this week. We've been here on a site visit. It's really nice property. So one of the other things I didn't mention about the expo uh, is the uh, sponsor prize giveaway. Uh, every single conference, we encourage our sponsors to bring some sort of cool prize to give away to the attendees. We've had drones, we've had cameras, we've had uh, watches, uh, we've had all kinds of like headphones and other things like that, you know, AirPods, you know, who knows. Um, but it's very important that you participate in that because during the actual evening, we've got a traffic driver, we're telling people to go around and chat with you guys, grab a little red ticket, a little raffle ticket. At the end of the evening, what I do is I walk around with a couple microphones, I walk up to your booth, and I say, you know, one of your, uh, uh, your personnel will actually uh, speak with me. Uh, and I basically ask them like, hey, tell me a little bit about your company. Tell me a little bit about what you guys are talking about here tonight. And we give them like, you know, the little 30 second elevator speech. And it's very lighthearted. We tried to have some fun. We try to make people laugh and those kind of things. So um, that's really important to make sure you guys are, uh, you pick somebody that's, uh, 
has the gift of gab, so to speak, and uh, can, can have some fun with it. At that point, we'll actually draw for the prize and, uh, you know, clap, 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 give away, and then I'll move on to the next actual person. Um, so that's a nice little traffic driver to get folks uh, to your booth, and it's very important. This year we're going to go, we're getting away from a bag, and we're going to go with a portfolio. And inside the portfolio, we'll be able to put your piece of collateral um, that you would like to, to give the attendees any information on your company and those kind of things. Um, you can send them now if you'd like. If not, you can wait for a little bit and, uh, and, and get them printed. We need probably about 300 of them. Um, we are going to need those in hand at STP and we'll provide the, the address on, uh, on the website at STP by April 2nd so that we can actually stuff the portfolios and get them sent out here to Newport Beach uh, to prepare for, the, uh, uh, for STP Con. So you want to send those to us, you can send them attention to me. Um, again, we'll have the address here for you as well. Booth materials, you're going to want to make sure you send your booth materials uh, to the hotel in plenty of time. We're asking that you actually have those uh, to the hotel by April 9th. Uh, and you probably don't want to get them there too much earlier or too much later. The hotel will charge you shipping uh, and handling fees once the actual boxes arrive, and if they're too early, they'll also charge you storage fees. Those, those items that you're sending for your booth and your booth personnel need to be marked uh, with your employee's information. So when it comes to the hotel, you should mark it with their name, dash STPCon, um, their phone number, everything that's uh, pertinent to them so that the hotel can get in touch with them once they've checked in and get them their materials. And that includes like any additional flyers or giveaways or uh, you know anything that you guys are giving away at the booth. Also your actual booth itself if you have a pop-up stand or something like that uh, or sign that goes behind the table um, that would be important to make sure you send in plenty of time. Speaking of the tables, um, we, we basically have, uh, uh, we give you a table, a uh, six foot black drape table. We'll actually provide power for you. Um, internet right now, we're looking at Wi-Fi out here. It seems pretty strong. So um, if you do have some particular items that you can actually run local on your machines, that might be good as well. We also will provide information on how to rent equipment. So if you want to rent a big screen or something like that, you can do that. I will say that being outside here, um, with the bigger screens and those kind of things, um, uh, the sun will start to go down and, and, and uh, it might make some of those screens a little bit difficult to read, but we'll figure out how to make that work for you. So if you're, say for instance, in a spot where you need a, uh, a screen for your particular presentation, we'll actually put that screen with the back to the sun so that folks can see it. Um, and we've done outdoor presentations uh, for the conference as well before in San Diego and it was actually really popular. People love being outside, especially in this weather. So April is supposed to be pretty nice. One of the things we get questions about is the QR uh, lead retrieval. Um, we do not actually uh, rent the lead retrieval devices or provide you the company to rent them from. We do things a little bit differently. We create QR codes that are on the back of everybody's badges. Um, your staff will use their own apps uh, their own phones to retrieve a lead uh, uh, from that particular QR code. It works out, it's been working out for us now for almost three years and uh, we've received really good feedback about it. It doesn't cost you any additional money um, and that's, that's kind of the key. So a little bit more information will be on the page about that. Uh, we'll include some, some ideas and links to apps to use. We just use the basic QR code reader app on iOS and it works great. So some of you have signed up for the demos uh, that we'll be running on Thursday. Uh, one thing to remember about the demos is to talk it up. Uh, so during the expo session uh, on Wednesday evening, talk up your demo. If you have a demo, encourage people to go to your demo. One other thing that some other vendors have done in the past is they've actually provided an additional prize at the demo uh, itself uh, to help draw people in there. So they'll either give away tickets at their, uh, at their booth um, or they'll actually give tickets away and they'll actually give tickets away as people are walking in and provide them uh, with uh, a chance to win a prize at the end of the demo. So uh, the more you talk up the demo and your social media and those kind of things, the better off you're going to be. Uh, it's, 
it's a great thing to do. A lot of people like learning about tools and technology. So make sure you talk it up at your booth, your table, or whatever for your extra demo. So everybody that signs up as a sponsor, you get different levels of sponsorship. Uh, you get actual registrations to the conferences included in your sponsorship. The most popular sponsorship, of course, is the showcase sponsorship, and that includes one full conference registration for April 11th uh, and 12th, um, those particular two days. That will give one of your staff members full access to the conference going in and out of sessions. Maybe they can go in there and do some networking and listen to people and hear what their challenges are. Those are generally the sponsors that do pretty well. They go in and they engage with the people uh, listening to what, what kind of things that they need, what kind of solutions they need in their daily work as software test professionals and QA uh, folks. So it's very important that we find out who that person is and you need to provide that information to us and we'll be reaching out to you soon to get that information from you. Um, you also have, uh, in the showcase sponsorship, you also have two booth passes for booth personnel. Um, that's in addition to your uh, full conference reg. The booth personnel can actually work uh, the booth uh, during the times that that's open. The, the times that it is open, again, is on Wednesday evening from 5 to 7. And again, on Thursday, all day long, we will have hallway tables in the main conference area and break areas. Uh, during that time as well. So that'll be additional time for you guys to be in front of the attendees as they're going in between sessions, coming out, having a cup of coffee, maybe a snack and those kind of things. Uh, they'll be able to engage with you there as well. So make sure you're prepared for the hallway tables as well. Uh, we talk about the conference badges. I, I mentioned uh, how many badges you get. Um, we'll need those people's full information. We need their name, their title, company, what town they're from, address, email address, and phone number. The reason why we need full contact information is part of the contract that we know everybody that's actually on site at the hotel actually knows who they are and that they belong there. So it's important to provide full information and we'll be reaching out to you uh, pretty soon uh, about you know, how to get us that information. And finally, like our social media. Of course, we're on social media. A lot of you do follow us. We also follow some of you. Um, we're on Facebook at Software Test Pro. We're on Twitter, at Software Test Pro, and we're on Instagram, at Software Test Pro. So we encourage your, uh, your, your folks that are here at the conference uh, to do some tweets about either their demo, or they can tweet about the expo, or you know, hey, come by and make sure you see us at the expo. We have a prize giveaway, that kind of thing. Also, Instagram's always fun, uh, taking a picture of your booth and, and tagging it with our hashtag of STPCon. Our ha that hashtag is across all three of our platforms, so Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So if you guys also, if you want to do some additional promotion for STPCon, uh, kind of promoting that you're going to be here, or if you have a demo, promoting your demo, uh, please do so. If you need an ad, uh, I can provide you an ad. Um, you know, I'm speaking at STPCon, that kind of thing. Uh, if you'd like to promote the conference to your email list or your customers, we can also provide you a discount code for your customers so that they can actually get a really good screaming deal to the actual conference itself. Uh, certainly do that. And if you need help with any of that, questions about any of that, definitely give me a call. Rick Bauckham, I'm always there. Uh, rbauckham at softwaretestpro.com. Uh, definitely let me know and I can help you out. Again, here's our contact information, all three of us here at STBCon. Again, we really appreciate you guys participating this year. We look forward to this conference. We look forward to being here in California. Can't wait to see you guys in April 9th through 12th, STBCon at the Marriott Newport Beach Hotel and Spa. Thanks a lot, take it easy.